guys and welcome back to another Let's Play The Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. Now I haven't played really all that much in the last couple of days. Uh, it is currently morning and the girls just went off to school and the babies are sleeping. They are supposed to age up today. But I think we're going to take advantage of this time where Enid's needs are good and everybody's gone from the house and the babies are sleeping to continue trying to get to know our neighbor because he is going to be our next baby daddy. Let's get started. Wound fix <laughs> it apparently takes a long time to invite somebody over. Oh, he looks sad. Why does everybody show up at our house sad? Uh, well, let's brighten his day. Try to cheer him up. Hello, where? <laughs> this game can be so odd sometimes. I. Floopy. Oh, Paul. Ah, Gorba. Oh, Copling Snarba. So we're just going to keep trying to get to know him. He's sad, so I'm not going to risk trying to flirt with him because that may destroy what little uh, romantic relationship we have. So we'll just keep going until he's happy. All right, we have an option to do a first kiss. Uh, should we... Yes, we became good friends with Sage uh -huh. Urn. She's our kid. Is this going to work? They always look so surprised during that first kiss. <laughs> and now our baby's crying. And we have to pee. <laughs> I don't know what he needs. Uh, we'll feed him. Oh, now this one's crying. Here we go. Alright, well, when she's done with that, we'll just keep working on this relationship with him. Really? Now this one's crying again? There, I'm putting the walls up so I can't hear the crying anymore. Alright. Yeah, she's like, I am so sick of these twins. Alright, stop talking to him. And go deal with your screaming kids. I mean, technically today is their birthday. We could age them up now. But I'm really not ready to be dealing with toddlers. It's so nice not having toddlers running around. But then again, it's nice not having the babies crying. So, you know... Oh, and now he's leaving. He's like, uh, you're really busy with your babies, so I'm just gonna leave. Peace out. And I really do want to move out of the desert. <laughs> I really don't want to continue to stay here in Oasis Springs. So we really need to start saving some money. Because I found a house which is it's pretty cool it was in it's in Brindleton Bay and it's a factory it was a cat food cannery factory that had been converted into a two-story home and I continued on with the renovations I moved it to a bigger lot because we need yeah. the room to renovate the place 
but it's pretty expensive. <laughs> but that's where I want to move. I want to move into a baby factory. <laughs> so as soon as we save up the money, we need about probably about 45,000 total in order to move. So that is our goal. It'll probably take a little bit longer, but that's where I want to go. Huh. Alright, I'm going to let her have some fun on the computer and play a game. Sam so. And the kids are home! Zogaga. Huh. Oh. It's Friday, so we have the whole weekend to work on skills and grades. Uh, I'm surprised the twins, Sage and Violet, aren't A students yet. But everybody's a B student, but we have the whole weekend to work on those grades. And all of the girls are in a tense mood. They've had no fun. Alright, well you know what? Here, you can go, go shoot around. All right, you're going to go read. Looks like everybody's going to go and read for fun. Well, that's fine. If that's what makes you feel better. I'm not going to make them do their homework right away because, you know, they need to get their fun up. And we have a bunch of skills we need to work on. Oh, she just hit herself in the face. Twice. <laughs> Alright, you are still tense. You need some more fun. So why don't you watch TV? Alright, she's doing okay. <laughs> and who is it that stinks to high heaven right now? She does. Okay, she's going to deal with it. I hope she's taking a shower. And not a bath. Well, of course she's taking a bath because, you know, that takes forever. And Lily still... Go watch TV. Evil and erratic. That's not a good combination for Lily. She is just... Oh my god! <laughs> Look at their faces! Oh my god! Neither one of them are very... <laughs> oh wow. Lily scares me. She reminds me of, like, a mean girl. <laughs> She's happy now. Near misery. Evil sins greatly enjoy reveling in the misery of others. Oh, see, everybody else is miserable, and she loves that. Alright, we have to get these kids working on... Have her just watch TV. Alright, Mom, you have to cook dinner. Alright. Bluebell, why don't you come in here and bounce? I'll have Bluebell go in there and... deal with her brother. Why does this seem so loud? Oh great, now the stove is broken. Alright, well who needs some skills? Here, you repair that. <laughs> oh good, Bluebell did a good job. She...
And then we're going to have Lily call everybody to meal. All right, mom is going to go see what this baby wants. Oh, you just want attention. Alright. This one needs a diaper change because he's dirty. Again. This baby craps himself all the time. I will take that before they start being responsible and cleaning things up. Okay, so it has been <laughs> a rough couple hours since the kids got home from school. And now this kid's hungry. And hopefully Stone just, I mean he's awake, but hopefully he goes to sleep. Alright, so we're going to let mom... Feed Iris. She's going to go back to sleep and we will be back in the morning. Oh, it is now Saturday and the children, the, the babies have not aged up to the toddler. So we are just going to go ahead and do that now because they were supposed to age up yesterday. So I'm going to have her just go ahead and age them up. And this weekend we really need the triplets to get their skills up because they need to get A's and they need to move out because Enid ages up in 11 days to an adult. So we definitely need to get pregnant. Okay, Stone is going to be fussy, wonderful, tiny troublemakers who love to cry, cause trouble and throw fits, but being noticed makes them happy and helps them overcome negative moodlets. Oh, cute. He's got black hair. Cool. All right, let her. Are you gonna put him down? <laughs> We're just gonna stand there staring. Oh, he's cute. Okay, now let's go. Age up, Iris. Yeah, put him down. I'm going to check his Long knees while we're waiting for Iris to age up. He's actually pretty good. So you know what? He can just go and stack some blocks. How about that? Oh, he's going to wait for his sister. <laughs> Alright, Iris. Angelic. Idyllic, easygoing toddlers. They are never defiant. And they don't throw a tantrum. They can easily talk to strangers. She is the exact opposite from her brother, <laughs> although they have the same hairstyle. Definitely need a makeover and <laughs> create a sim. <laughs> what is that outfit? <laughs> Alright, and Iris, her needs are good, but you know what, let's have mom, we're just gonna since mom's knees are good, we're just going to go and potty train Iris right now. That way we get a jump start on things and I'm not scrambling to get the potty training done. And when she's done potty training her, we're going to let Stone, we'll get him on the potty as well. It might be a little difficult considering he's fussy, but I really don't care. Alright, he didn't give her a hard time about it, which is good. All right, good. Go play dolls.
And the kids that are up, I'm going to have them start working on skills. Alright, the toddlers are handled. So, Rose is sleeping. Lily's showering and then she's going to eat. What are her skills? She has none, except for video gaming. Well, she wants to be a master mixologist, which means she's going to need the cooking skill. So, let's give her... She can make some garden salads. So she's going to work on cooking. That'll be her thing. And then Bluebell, she's still sleeping, but... Rose, she wants to be a romantic, so I can really pretty much put her in any skill. She's got handiness, but there's really nothing for her to do, so... Um, I don't know... You know what she can do? You know, you're not taking a bubble bath. If you want to take a shower, you can take a shower. And then you can go work on playing a game. Where is she going? She's taking a tour around the house. Bluebell. She needs fun. She's hungry. She needs hygiene. Lily is still in the shower. I'll have her come down, take a shower. <laughs> this is a typical teenager. <laughs> typical teenager with the mood swings. It's quite it's quite entertaining actually. Just like her mom. I'm conflicted about having them, um... Oh, I could give one of them the gardening skill. They could help out here. A missing toy. I was thinking about one of my favorite toys and can't find it. I'm starting to miss it and feel sad. Well, let's work on responsibility. Keep looking. Oh, and Violet has finally woken up. She's going to handle getting herself some food. Uh, I'm going to check on the toddlers. Do they need food? Oh, you're okay. Are you still not finished making that garden salad? This house is a hot mess right now. There are no orders to anything. Alright, well, Mom, you decided not to go to sleep when I told you to, so you know what? We need to clean the shower. How about that? And then you can go to sleep. Sage, don't. Did you find your toy? <laughs> oh, cool. Look, Bluebell is actually taking care of the plants. Because I don't know if I didn't actually give her a skill. She wants to be a purveyor of potions. But she has no skills. Okay, this child must be done eating. Alright, Stone, he's tired. So, you know what? Go to sleep. And Iris, same thing. Go to sleep. Alright, Bluebell, since you... Why aren't these being watered? I feel like... Go ahead and water. Uh -huh. Alright, I'm just going to give her the gardening skill because, you know, people who need potions, they're going to have to, you know, 
grow their own ingredients anyways, I think. And I'm just going to go ahead and replace this because now it's a mess. But... Alright. I need to get these girls to do their homework. So... Sage, you are doing your homework. Or you're doing extra credit. Good job. I really need to work on them getting their responsibility Sounds up within like range as well. <laughs> Great, Sage. We're going to make some summer you. crafts. Oh, sure. <laughs> well, I told you to use the toilet first. Uh, yeah, I know. You're so... Your life is so unfair. <laughs> your life is so unfair, Rose. <sighs> you know, while you're in there, you know, mop this up. Alright, so the girl, everybody seems to have something to do right now. I feel like we need to buy a better TV so that they can watch or get another game system because it's taking forever to get their fun up. <laughs> oh good, Lily's got a skill to level 3. So after that, if she does her extra credit, we'll let her eat, and then she can do her extra credit, and hopefully that will help get the responsibility trait up, because I feel like it's really low. No, Lily's not coming over to hang out, Marcus. And why are you going to invite one of your kids, not all three? Doesn't make any sense. Alright, we're going to watch the cooking channel. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to give her the cooking skill as well. Okay, next. Lily, when you are done. Do extra credit. I will take that because that is money. Let's see, I want these guys all to be up on their skills. So I'm going to pause it for a second just so I can keep track of everybody. Alright, you need to get a skill to level 3, and you have none. You just started the cooking skill. I don't know what skill to give her. I mean, we could do cooking or baking. Although I'm afraid she's going to set the house on fire. Alright, you can do a garden salad. You are doing extra credit. And Enid's cooking again. I don't know why. And she's doing extra credit. Alright, get off the video games. Actually, that is going to be... That is going to be your skill. You're just going to get your video game skill up. All right, let's see. Sage, where's your skill at? You're at level three. You have to be at four, though. This kid's gonna hate me. There we go. And when you're done, you can <laughs> Do some more holiday crafts. Do some gnomes. 
Violet, where are we at with you? How about you just go play? There you go. Okay, Bluebell. Did you get food? Making friends. I really want to be friends with someone, but they don't seem to really want to be friends with me. How can I make them my friend? Well, just keep being friendly. We'll work on the manners. And what's your skill? You're not even there. I don't even have a place to put these. Yeah, sure, right there is good. And then go draw, because you're not going to bed. <laughs> I'm so mean. I'm, I'm a drill sergeant. <laughs> Yeah, Mom, why did you just walk in on her? Get out of the bathroom. Actually had no reason to go in there. Yeah, go take a shower in there. Alright, I'm gonna check on the twins. They're actually doing okay. Sleeping a lot. Where in the world is their tablets? Probably in their inventory. Yep. So get up. Play some shape. And stone. He sound asleep. But he is also going to need to get up. And play sim shape. I'll let them do that and then we'll have mom do some more potty training. Rose is doing extra credit. <laughs> I feel like this has been the longest day ever. All right, guys, so I'm going to leave this episode here for today. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you want to see more, please like and subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.